hello guys welcome back to my channel if this is your first time here you are very welcome my name is pinta and i share cooking contents here so in today's video i'm gonna share with you guys kucha durama or bisab so if you want to see how i make this bisab stick around with me if this is your first time here you are very welcome if you haven't subscribed to my channel click that subscribe button say subscribe and click the bell anytime i post a new video you will be notified these are all the ingredients I'm going to use as you see. Now what I'm doing, I'm just dicing the vegetables. I'm chopping the spring onion or some people call it scallion. And then I'm going to dice some fresh tomatoes and onion, one onion and four tomatoes and one bell pepper, um, orange bell pepper or yellow. Whatever you like, you can use. Um, but this is optional. So I like the flavor of the yellow the pepper. So that's why I'm using it. You don't have to, but it's optional, as I say. So the next thing, the next step, I'm gonna start adding water, and then I will add the vegetables, and I will add some seasoning. I'm using here vegetable seasoning, and then along with salt, and then now I'm gonna add i'm gonna add the fish i'm using tilapia one tilapia then i cut it in the middle then i add the tilapia you can use um other type of the fish it's up to you the option then i put the lid on cover it then i add okra to make my pizza and spinach and if you don't see if you want to see the recipe of the bisab full i have a video you can check that video then i'm gonna boil the bisab with the, the you know spinach and yeah now the soup it's already boiled then i add some two and a half tablespoon of um tomato paste or tomato puree whatever <laughs> Then I just mix it, let it come to boil. That is going to be a soup. It's going to be a side. Yeah. Then I will add some little bit of seasoning. And I make, I add lime, half lime juice. With um, half lime. Yeah. And then let it come to boil. And I add two habanero pepper. Let it simmer for maybe 10 minutes around 10 minutes while that is happening i'm gonna move on to the pizza now i'm just the okra and the spinach is cooked i'm gonna transfer it to make the pizza then i'm gonna squeeze to take all the liquid out i don't need any liquid there but i'm gonna add lots of lemon juice give me the lot of sour so i add um, i squeeze as much as you can then i add dawa dawa the knitted too and salt and some vegetable seasoning and some one habanero pepper spice, and lots of lemon juice lime juice lime or lemon both work but i'm using lime the taste is different lime with lemon I prefer using lime, but sometimes you don't have lime, you can use lemon. Yeah. Then now the soup is simmer very nicely. I'm going to take the fish and put it in the bowl. And I add some more soup. The pepper soup is very nice with the pizza. It's a very nice side dish. And now I'm going to add geja, the salty fish. The fillet face and salty one. I'm gonna add that one little boil maybe for around five. Then now I'm adding the lalo na. Um, the green thing is a boba leaf flower, so I'm gonna add that one. If you google it, you will see the yeah boba leaf flower. So I'm gonna add it and stir it. Then I will add the pizza. Then I mix it through and let it cook very low heat for around 10 minutes then i will before that i will add palm oil a little bit of palm oil 
I'm gonna add some palm oil. Not too much, just yeah. Yeah, I add the palm oil and let it simmer away around 10 to 15 minutes. Very low heat. And after 15 minutes, as you can see, this is how the pizza look like. It's very nice. You have to try this recipe if you haven't. If you have all the ingredients, please try this recipe out. And if you try it, let me know and come back and tell me how does it taste like. Yeah, I have it with rice and yeah and i'm gonna add uh, pepper soup it's gonna be the side fish you know it's so delicious guys this was very delicious yeah thank you so much for watching thank you so much for thank you so much for watching and i will see you guys soon bye yeah i will catch you guys soon in my next video